Hi, my name is Sarsa. I am your refractive surgery advisor. I will assist you in making the proper decision in all types of refractive surgery by processing the input data and generating useful calculations, warnings, and recommendations. I will take you on a quick tour to learn how to use the program and get the most out of what I will recommend for you. You can rewatch this tutorial at any time by clicking on Tour. At the top of this screen, you can see the toolbar that will stay with you throughout the program. If you click on the notebook sign, you can see the definitions of the abbreviations used in the program. Please try to make yourself familiar with the abbreviations before you start. In the middle of the toolbar is the process bar that shows the step you are in. When you start a new case, the program will guide you through the steps in order, so you cannot skip over a step. In the first step, Start, there are two options in Profession. Select Day when most of the patient's activities are during the day, and select Night when most activities are during the night. Fill in the patient's demographics and press on Validate to move to the validation step. In the validation step, SARSA validates the tomography and checks its reliability. If the tomography is invalid, you may need to rule out factors of false findings, as will be shown in the message. The next step is the Practical Subjective Scoring System, the PS3. The PS3 is designed by Professor Sinjab to assist you in making the proper decision in laser-based refractive surgery. You can select the system that best fits your practice. After filling the blanks and pressing the PS3 button, SARSA will process the data and will display one of the three messages. All laser-based options are applicable. Some of them. Or none of them. In the Refractive Surgery step, select the type of refractive surgery you are planning to do. Under each type, all subtypes are checked by default. You can uncheck the subtypes you wish to exclude from the processing. After filling the blanks, click Get Results to let SARSA process the data and present the results and recommendations. The laser-based results will be displayed first. To get the lens-based results, click on the Refractive Surgery step. Choose the lens-based option, and then press Get the results. You can print the results by clicking the Print button. At any step, you can hover over the gear sign to reset the data and start from the beginning, or just reset the step you are in. The program saves a record of your patients. You can check the records by clicking on the arrow on the right side of the screen. You may load a record or delete it. When you load a complete case, the program will take you directly to the results. When you load an incomplete case, the program will take you to the step that you last completed. You can move in between the steps when all the steps are completed. When all the steps are still not completed, you can step only backward if you want to make some edits. Please feel free to send feedback or ask the SARSA team any questions. Thank you for choosing SARSA.